we will uh, see today how random pile access functions work hmm? so there will be some file and we will see how it how we can write a small program to delete a line in the program right so what should be the basic algorithm open a file hmm? if you open the file let's think and then write the code okay there is a file there are some contents now first question is how we can do it so we have to open the file in which from which we want to delete a line if you open a file in read mode you cannot delete because read mode helps you to read the data hmm? if you use the r plus mode there are chances you can read the data and write to the file hmm? that is one way of replacing the i mean deleting that line another algorithm might be open the file one file in a read mode hmm? open another file in a write mode a kind of a temporary file likewise no when you want to swap contents of two variables so we took help of some temporary variable using that temporary variable we swap the contents of two variable that is a basic program in pointer cc so here we will open the file and we will open another temporary file the file which we have opened in read mode we will go on reading lines and then user will give a user will give a prompt which line is to be deleted so it will give a line number Hmm? so till that line number we will copy contents of one file into a temporary files okay and the line which is to be deleted we will not copy that the rest of the lines again we will copy to the temporary file this is one of the algorithm right and then we will discard that original file and the temporary file will be uh, we can rename that file right so i will this is just a brief algorithm so open a file in suppose read mode hmm? open one file suppose one file in read mode Hmm. open a temporary file in write mode hmm. then ask the user to uh, first what we can do print first print contents of we can print only when the file is small print contents of file ask the user line to be deleted okay copy contents of file to temporary file excluding the line to be deleted right 
copy the contents. Discard original file and rename temporary file. That's it. Okay. Uh, what I mean, suppose this is one file, this is another file. Okay. Suppose this is the file uh, as uh, I will save it first. Suppose message. Huh? This is a file message.txt. Okay. So some contents are there. If we want to delete this line, okay. Suppose there is some line to be deleted. Okay. Now we want to delete suppose this line. What we can do is take the file pointer here, positional pointer I mean, copy the contents. Okay. But we need to copy all these contents. So we have to put it inside the loop character by character and copy these contents okay so copy put in a temporary file right this file has got name as uh, temp right then this file is to be deleted this line is to be deleted so we will not copy this then copy this right then line by line everything will be copied that's it but what next now This file needs to be deleted now. Okay. Remove that file. Okay. So there is a library function remove. Okay. What it will do? It will remove the file from the hard disk. Okay. So when I close this file, It is no more on the buffer. Okay. So we will call the remove function. When you call the remove function, this file is no more there. Right? So this file will be deleted. It is gone now. Okay. And then we will save this file as a message. That's it. Okay. Now, this is actually what we want. Delete the line from the file. Delete specific line from the file. Right. So, we will write the same program. So, we need two pointers. Suppose star fp and star ft okay ft is a pointer for temporary file right we will declare some variable as can ch because we will access character by character. Hmm? There should be one variable to line number huh? because we are going to take that input. Hmm? 
then int number of lines and uh, what we will do we will create a file and we won't create a file what we will do is we will uh, we'll take a ready-made file right so fp is equal to f open some file we will keep it there okay the same file we will keep it here here is that file message okay uh, we will keep it in what is the program name delete deleting a line this we will save this file is this file here so at least we won't need to write it hmm? now we'll open this file first so message.txt and we'll open it in the R mode. Okay. CH equals CH is equal to F get C declare this as the int let hmm? get c fp uh, not equal to eol What we will do? Uh, we can uh, send put care. Do we give any function? Because we are print. We want to get character from that file and put character. Put care ch. Right. Uh, let's first check whether this works. Let's see. Hmm. Yeah, so at least we'll add some contents in that way. Line right. if I run this code, uh, contents of the file are there. Hmm? And this line suppose we want to delete or any line so obviously one should what happened mm. what we can do is we ask the user enter the line number you want to delete We'll take this from the user per 
and line number so we we'll take it from the user right oh here we should not close this file because temporarily we need to open the file another file so ft is equal to if open temp dot txt and we will open it in a write mode hmm? what we can write first of all we have read this uh, we have read this file we have read this file so that positional pointer is at the end of that file so once we need to start accessing that uh, file again we have to write while ch equal to f get c p these brackets are sometimes not equal to eoa before this what we have to do we have to rewind that which one is p so take the positional pointer at the top of the file there onwards we will start accessing that hmm? so we can write if ch equals slash n suppose hmm? because new line is there new line is is uh, can be detected by whether character read is slash in or not right what i will do i will increase the line number increment the line number so you have to initialize it to suppose one right so i will write in ol plus plus right now if <clears throat> in ol equals line number not equals or equals what we can do we'll write as not equals if we put c that send that character to f t right? as it is so suppose we reach at the end of the file if close we we'll close that file fp right we will close that ft as well 
remove that file. So remove function is there. We you need to send the uh, not pointer. Now here pointer is no more uh, comes into the picture. You need to send the name of the file. So send here message dot txt. Right. There is a one more function called rename. Okay. This is this function is like strcmp uh, function or strcat if you can recall which all these functions take two arguments. Similarly, rename takes two arguments. Okay. Then uh, we will see what is the arguments is uh, the file to be renamed. And the new name. The new name we will give as the original name. We'll give some message here. Mine is deleted. Program is raw, but it will it should work. Let's see. So suppose I run this code. So there is Enter the line number to be deleted. So suppose I write two. Hmm? So we'll check whether line is deleted or not. So that line is not there, right? We'll try some more times. Line suppose six, line seven. Okay. Line eight. Okay. Hmm? We'll save this file. We'll run that. Uh, we'll put one more slash in here. Why it directly it came line number to be deleted? checks here. I don't know whether file was opened or not. I think uh, if, if we equals none. It doesn't exist
Oh, file doesn't exist. That means Okay, okay. Triple S is there. Mystical. M E W same file name we have not given that. That is a problem. Hmm? What is the problem? There is not a document. Contents are not there. Okay, we'll write some contents here. Line one, line two, line three. Four, five, six. Say this. Yeah, and enter the line you want to delete. Suppose line number three is to be deleted. So line is deleted. We will see. Yeah, so line three is deleted. Okay. Uh, now see, temp file is not there because uh, temp file is exclusively for the temporary only. So message file is there. We created temporary in during the program execution. During the execution of the program, we removed this original file and renamed that text uh, temporary file as original name was given to that. Okay. So this is a kind of a uh, no algorithm by which. Line can be deleted. Hmm? 